Hello, and welcome to episode three. So, as you know, if you saw the other uh, episode two, I didn't do audio commentary that time. Um, I, well, to be honest, it's because my child was sleeping, <laughs> but uh, I kind of think maybe it's something that people might like. I mean, I sometimes, you know, if you just have videos in the background or whatever, it can be nice, you know, just to have some game sounds and uh, that sort of thing without someone talking over them. So if that's something that you guys, I'm speaking like if anyone actually watches these videos, but you know, maybe one day, uh, if you guys like that, then let me know so I can, you know, make more of them. Um, yeah, I've still got a bit of a weird cold, so my voice is all over the place. Um, that definitely needs moving, but I'm just kind of wondering which way to go. I feel like kind of just digging this area out quite a bit more first. A few times in the past, I've literally dug out, you know, sort of three high in every direction until I've hit, you know, like the outside of the hill or the mountain or whatever it is. Um, that could be an idea to kind of have like a big open space. Makes it a bit easier for, you know, if I'm building farms or anything inside. Um, but maybe not one to do in a, a single video. That might be one for later. But for now, I'm just going to kind of expand this out a little bit and See if anything comes to my head as I mine. I feel like I do want to make an actual, uh, you know, proper deep mine soon. Maybe I'll do that uh, in the next few minutes. I'm not even sure if there's, you know, better ways of doing any of this stuff nowadays. But back when I played, I'd usually build a staircase down and I think you'd go to around level 12 to sort of 15 and then you know you could do the whole kind of uh, branch mining whatever it was called branch mining tree mining whatever it is basically mining a big long line and then mining little branches off them um in an efficient way so you can kind of see as many you know uh, rock faces without having to mine that much you know, for actually, if you, when you're trying to find iron and gold and diamonds and everything else, uh, it's probably better ways of doing it these days that I'm not aware of, but I think I'll start with that. I have now got my new microphone, so hopefully the audio is better than before. Um, it might take a couple of videos or more to, uh, you know, dial in the settings and everything else. Uh, annoyingly, I did make a sort of 30 minute video on the game Firewatch that looked like one that was would be interesting to play. And yeah, for that 30 minutes, the audio was fine, but the uh, game capture didn't work, so I just had a, a black screen for half an hour. So that's annoying. Uh, I think I'll probably replay it. I mean, it'll be a bit weird if I just you know, uh, I don't know if you're aware of the game, but I got, I just did the first day, um, I've never played it before, so maybe half an hour sounds like a long time, but yeah, I did that, and then, but yeah, I just said I didn't record the game, so that was a bit annoying, um, so I'll probably end up replaying that at some point, if it's something you'd be interested in, let me know, um, but yeah, I feel like at least for now, I'm gonna, uh, you know, uh, play mainly kind of just you know, chill, relaxed games. Um, I mean, it, it kind of suits my gaming style. You know, I don't, 
there's a few non-relaxing games I do play, but I mainly just like to play games like Minecraft just to, you know, uh, relax more than anything else. Uh, you know, busy life and everything else. I don't need to be running around with guns too much. It's just nice to have a game like Minecraft that you can come to and, you know, when you're not there it's paused and then you can come back and carry on where you left off. It it works nicely. Um, yeah, let's... I just want to make sure... I just want to check how sort of big this area is. I mean, it seems pretty massive. I feel like I should do something horrible, like a tower or something so I don't lose this area. Um, and I can't remember what the F keys are to bring up the coordinates and everything else. It's T to type. Uh, I don't know if that's even a command. Yeah, there's definitely a F key to get that kind of coordinates and everything else up, but oh, let's try. F3? That was a good guess. Uh, X, Y, Z, 140, 89, 189. Right. Okay, that's there for future reference in the video, if I ever get massively lost. But yeah, I... I mean, it'd be fun to kind of dig around this kind of rounded area just so I've got like a lookout the entire way around and then potentially in areas where it's really tall, like it seems to be all of it, have multiple floors where, you know, have a staircase going up and then have a, again, like having a kind of, um, I mean, I'd most likely replace this fence with glass when I, you know, get further into the game, but I think it'd be kind of cool if I had the kind of weirdly shaped house kind of shaped around this uh, hill. And then with different layers of glass and things, potentially going all the way to the top. Uh, sounds interesting. Um, yeah, let's let's just do a bit of mining and see what happens. So, how many torches did I have? Forty-two, and I got a bunch of pickaxes. Got some food. I remember the good idea was always to have, um, to always have, oh my god, my brain isn't working, to always have a bucket, that's the word, with uh, water, for obvious reasons with lava and everything else, that was always a good idea to bring with you when you went mining, but again, I don't really have any iron. Um, I think that needs to be one level higher so I can actually run down and I'll probably make this into a proper staircase later on. Definitely want that mod that puts, switches the right weapon. But yeah, I usually, I usually do this, mine down in this kind of way. Um, I've got to remember that you guys probably can't see anything when I don't have lights. I feel like when the torch is in your hand, it's supposed to light up the area you're in, doesn't it? I imagine that. It's not the whole reason why you'd want them in your hand. Let me know. If that's the thing, or if I've just imagined it, or maybe it was a mod. Yeah, I'm hoping the uh, microphone's good. I, yeah, I did have the Blue Yeti um, USB microphone, and I've switched out to a full kind of um, XLR setup. If anyone knows mics, I've got a Shaw XM7B. I think it was SSM7B. I think it was called, and a uh, Focus Right. Yeah, focus right, uh, solo, fourth generation audio mixer thingy 
I'm not really, uh, I don't really know my mics, but I did some research and it sounded like a good option. So yeah, I went with it and hopefully it's uh, gonna be a bit of an upgrade. I always think, you know, good audio quality is important for videos. You know, these days, most people have good video quality. And it's not like back in years back when people's internet connection was worse and people had, you know, lower end computers and you'd you'd have much you know, more pixelated videos. I feel like nowadays nearly everyone has, you know, decent video, but audio can still sometimes be lacking. And yeah, it always always puts me off if I if I watch a video and the audio just sounds terrible. Or it sounds like the person's in a toilet or a fishbowl or something. Um what's that key? F three. Oh, not that key. Oh, was it not that key? Oh god. What am I pressing here? Technical difficulties. <laughs> Let's try again. There we go. Uh, okay, what are we on? This is X, Y, Z. 205. Really? Oh, it's Y, isn't it? Is it? Am I... Am I being daft here? Isn't this Z height? Uh, okay, I've, I'm being an idiot, it seems like. Yeah, that's sticking at 88, isn't it? Okay, so it is the y-axis. I don't know what I'm thinking. Okay, uh, so where were we? Only oh, yeah, 68. Okay, let's get rid of that. 68. Yeah, I assume, uh, you know, diamonds and everything else is still relatively good. I don't know if there's sort of better things now. I don't have any idea what this is. Raw copper. I don't know if this is worth getting, but may as well while I'm here. I wonder if you can make bronze. Is it tin and copper? Or is that just runescape? <laughs> um, okay. Always feels so slow with stone weapons or stone tools, doesn't it? Hopefully, in a few days, this cold will leave me alone and I can talk a bit more normal. I feel like if I talk too too loud, my throat gets really irritated. Some kind of half whispering. Is that more granite? Looks very similar to uh, dirt. And again, I have no reason, no reason, no idea how to, uh, what granite even does. Granite, I keep going with granite, granite. Guess I can use that recipe feature. See what I can build with it. 
seems pretty common, so I'm assuming it's, you know, not very, not massively useful. Maybe it's more for building. Did I place that torch there? I guess so. Some sort of change in music. I do like Minecraft music. It's very relaxing, I always think. Oh, there we go, some iron. Hopefully there's a lot. That's not looking very promising, is it? I shouldn't have said. Hopefully there's a lot. Hmm. Really? One? I don't think I've ever had that before. Some coal and more. Was that copper? I think so. What is that gravel or what is that? Andesite. Is that am I supposed to get andesite? I don't. I don't know. Kind of feels not great. This sounds like a new a new music track from what I can remember. I guess they've added more to it over the years. It's kind of a spooky one. Um what are we did uh, forty two, okay. You feel like we're nearly there. Evidently not. I mean, I don't really need to be making this uh, too wide. There's no reason to do it, but I won't. We'll live. Makes it slightly less claustrophobic. I feel like iron is a, a lot of sparser these days. I feel like back when I played, you'd always get, you know, at least, I don't know, six ore from one. 
Do you always get... Is it gone? Oh, there. Yeah. I was going to say, do you always get that raw iron stuff instead of uh, the ore? Like the old days. I guess you do. I just didn't know if it was that. Uh, my silk pickaxe thing from the first episode. Alright, we must be at about 30 or so now. Maybe I'll make a minecart or something to get down here. This must be some pretty exciting viewing. Is that something new? I feel like, is that supposed to be gold? I feel like from the speed, I need iron to get that. I'm guessing. And I'm assuming it's gold, but it does not look like what it used to. How many pickaxes do we have? It's the last one. We are flying through these. And here's a skeleton. Does that mean we're near a cave, maybe? I should have. That, yeah, half the reason I'm adding torches is to stop monsters spawning. If that's, again, still a thing. I hope so. It's very weird playing a game you used to know so well so many years ago and now it feels so different I mean obviously you know the basics are the same but so many things could have changed and so many things have changed it's like it's like playing a different version of a game you played like a an updated version obviously it is updated but you know what I mean like Minecraft 2 I think I'm going to have to head back in a second. My pickaxe is nearly busted. Yeah, and this is why you put stairs down. Have I done it deep enough for the stairs not to bang your head, or do I need to go down another level? I can never remember. I guess we can test that. Okay, dump a load of this stuff. Do we have any more of these? Nope. How many, how many torches? 21 torches. Let's make some more torches and 
I'm gonna have to move this because it's annoying me. Um, how long have we been recording now? 25 minutes. Okay, let's give it another five. Um, let's first make some more chests. Why should we have chests? So we make Oh yeah. <laughs> that wasn't good. Uh was there another one there? I think there was. I feel like wherever I'm gonna put them now I'm gonna move them. I might just kind of have them against this wall for now. And I could. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Like I could have them here. And then make a gap. Yeah, that still works. And you can't. Oh, can you do that now? Ah. Does that mean? Okay, yeah, I mean, you didn't used to be able to put chests next to one another. They had to be a, a one block gap and you couldn't put a chest above another chest, I'm pretty sure. It either wouldn't work or you couldn't open it, but I guess that means I can block up that hole as well. Can I get to it? Ah. Yeah, it won't open now, so I was kind of right. So let's explode this and start half. Let's say this can be wood of sorts. Can be dirt. That could be cobblestone and other random bits. I don't know what they are. That can be random, random stuff for now. Like. Yeah, this gonna be kind of whatever for now. Until I work out netherrack. Should we go and bin off these wooden tools as well? Because we don't need those. Let's throw them to the Fairies or something. Um, okay, I think that's a very random way to end, but yeah, it works. Maybe this can be my slightly more valuable chest. With things I think are valuable, which may not be. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, well, thanks for watching again, and uh, see you in the next one.